Please help me welcome David Gonzalez. <laughs> Once upon a time, there was a lion whose teeth were so sharp, whose claws were so long, and whose roar was so loud. Let me hear you guys roar. One, two, three. <laughs> His roar was so loud that all of the other animals were like, ah! And they ran away. And of course, this made the lion feel sad. And that sadness made him mad. So mad that all the lion could do from the morning to the night was roar, roar. Yeah, but uh, sometimes the lion gets sleepy. Yeah. And one day the lion stretched and fell asleep just like that. With his arm laid out and his hand wide open, the lion fell sound. Uh. And while the lion was lying there, along came the other animal in our story. A little gray animal with a long curly tail, long whiskers, loves to eat cheese. It was the... <coughs> yeah. The mouse was minding his own business, right? <laughs> the mouse wasn't bothering nobody. The mouse didn't see the lion lying there, and the mouse tippy-tiptoed right into the lion's open hand. Now I need everyone in this room to hold up one hand like this and spread your fingers out as wide as they can go. Then, yo, take your other hand and with your fingernail, scratch as fast as you can right in the middle. It tickles! So, of course, the lion woke up with a great big... Who woke me up? Why, you dirty little rat. And the lion lifted the mouse up by his long tail. The lion opened his mouth and was about to drop the mouse in when the mouse said, wait, wait a minute, Mr. Lion. Hey, look, hold it right there. Look, I don't mean nothing to you, but I mean a whole lot to me. And if you set me free, maybe one day I could come back and uh, I could help you. Yeah, right. You, a little mouse, help me. I don't think so. You can't help me. I'm big and bad. Get out of here, mouse. You're making me mad. I'm the leader. I'm the king. Who are you, mouse? Just a little thing. Goo goo gaga. <laughs> Did you hear what he said? This little mouse thing's sick. <laughs> yeah. Hey, hey, wait a minute. Uh, hey, I was just laughing. I haven't laughed in a long time. Uh, hey, look, mouse. You made me laugh, so uh, I'm going to set you free. But I'm warning you, don't come around here again or in my mouth you'll be. Now scram and don't. Come back. He threw the mouse in the air. The mouse is like, Yahoo! <laughs> the mouse ran into the woods and the, and, the and the lion fell back. Uh, shh. Now, that day in the jungle, there were three hunters from the circus. They had a great big net over their shoulders. They had binoculars. They were looking for animals to bring back. They were looking for lions and tigers and bears. Don't leave me hanging. Lions and tigers and bears. Lions and tigers and bears. Lions and tigers and bears. And tigers and bears. Oh my. Look, said the first hunter. There's a lion down there and he's sound asleep. Let's get him with our net. So the hunters took their net and they tip tip toed. 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 And they snuck up to the sleeping lion. 
And the hunters took their net and they threw it right over the lion. And of course the lion woke up with a great big... (laughs) And he roared so loud that the hunters became frightened and they ran away and left the lion trapped that day. And sure, the lion tried to get out, but the more he struggled, the more tangled up he became. And after a while, the lion's roar sounded like, meow. And then the great big lion said, I, I, I want my mommy. (laughs) The lion started crying. And guess who heard the lion crying? Our little friend, the? It sounds like somebody's in trouble. It sounds like the lion is crying. Hey, I bet I could help him. I know I could help him. In fact, I'm going to go right back there and I'm going to... Maybe not. He said, if I go back there, I'm going to go right in. (laughs) Should I go or should I stay? I don't want to go. I don't want to go. Okay, I'll go. And so the mouse tip tip toed. He tip tip toed. He tip tip toed. He tip tip toed. He tip tip toed. And he snuck up to the trap line. The lion didn't even know he was there. And the mouse picked up a corner of the net. Everybody, hold it right there. <clears throat> And then the mouse started to chew on the net with a ch-ch-ch-ch. And he chewed some more. Ch-ch-ch-ch. And he chewed some more. Ch-ch-ch-ch. Ch-ch-ch-ch. Ch-ch-ch-ch-ch-ch-ch-ch-ch-ch-ch-ch-ch-ch-ch-ch-ch-ch-ch-ch-ch-ch-ch-ch-ch-ch-ch-ch-ch-ch-ch-ch-ch-
put the tippy tip of his claw into the mouse's little hand. And they shook hands like, ee, ee, ee. And they gave a high five like, oh, cool. And of course they became friends. The lion and the mouse became. And you know what? They lived happily ever. Thank you very much.